Hello and welcome to today's class, which is called the Dancing Warrior Sequence. So just start at the very top of your mat. Hands in prayer, in a lap, extend the arms towards the ceiling, gaze up and exhaling, bend the knees, bend the elbows and try to dive forward in your first Uttanasana. Belly to your thighs, relax your neck and shoulders. Inhale gently, unroll your spine and come up once more. Inhale, hug the sky, go up, try to reach the ceiling with your fingertips and exhale, dive forward once more. Stay here. Big deep breath, then place your hands onto your shin and try to lengthen your spine as much as possible. Push the shoulders back far from your ears. Exhale, hands to your mat, relax your neck. Breathe here. On the next inhale, gently come up. Hands towards the ceiling, exhale, hands in prayer, just in front of your heart. Inhale, once more, reach up. Exhale, dive forward for your Uttanasana. Step back with both your legs. Stay here, lift your tailbone up towards the sky, push the ground away with your hands and go for your first downward facing dog. Keep the knees bent if you want. In and lift up the left leg, up with the right heel and step the left foot just in between your hands. Drop down the knee and on the next inhale come up, extend towards the ceiling, exhale, point your elbows out and towards the ground, your heart towards the sky. Inhale and exhale, hands to the ground once more. Tuck your toes, open up the right foot at 45 degrees and lift up for your first warrior one. Try to drop the shoulders down, hips squared. Stay here and breathe and then open up to your warrior two so the back foot is parallel to the short side of your mat. Reverse your warrior, so go down with your right hand. Try to go further, a little bit further, imagine touching your ankle and extend the left arm over your head. Inhale and exhale, count down. So the left hand touching the ground or a block if you want and extend the other arm over your head. Feel your skin and muscles stretching as much as possible. Feel the space you are creating. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, place your hands back onto your mat and go for your plank pose. Navel towards the spine, drop the knees, the chest, your chin and slide forward. Keep the elbows bent and lift up the chest. For your first upward facing dog or your cobra pose, tuck your toes, shift the weight back, bring your tailbone up towards the sky, lengthen the spine and on the next inhale, lift up the right leg towards the ceiling, bend the knee and place the foot just in between your hands, lengthen the spine, drop your left knee down, inhale, lift up. Gaze towards the sky, exhale, open up the chest, bend the elbows, inhale, come back to center, exhale, place your hands down and step back. Place your back foot at 45 degrees, open up to warrior one, feel your hips squared, 
shoulders away from the ears, open up the sun to your warrior two. Inhale and on the next exhale, reverse your warrior and enjoy the deep stretch on the right side of your body. Inhale, come up. Exhale, place the right hand onto the ground or on your block and extend the other arm over your head. Breathe here. And inhale, come back to center. Exhale, release your hands to the ground. Step back with both feet and gently go down. Chaturanga or drop your knees first. Inhale, extend your elbows a little bit more. Open up the chest, gaze towards the sky. Breathe here. Relax the front side of your body. Exhale, tuck your toes. Hands just beneath your shoulders. Shift back and tailbone up. Downward facing dog. Navel towards the spine. Relax the neck. Lengthen your spine. Keep the knees bent if you want. Inhale, lift the leg up towards the sky and place the foot in between your hands. This time, don't drop the back knee. Lengthen your spine as much as you can. Open up the back foot at 45 degree for your first warrior. Inhale, extend up. Try to lift and lengthen the spine. Exhale, warrior two. And gently feel your strength and your core here. And on the next exhale, reverse your warrior for your peaceful one. Stay here and breathe. Inhale, lift up back and place the left hand onto your mat. Extend the right arm over your head. Inhale, come back to warrior two and on the next exhale, place your hands back onto your mat and go for your plank pose and straight into Chaturanga. Inhale, lift your hips and thighs up, open up the chest, upward facing dog this time. So extend your arms completely and exhale back to downward facing dog. Navel to the spine, stretch your back, stretch your arm string. Inhale. Lift up the right leg and place your foot just in between your hands. Inhale, lengthen the spine. Create space into your back and open up the back foot at 45 degrees, hip squared, warrior one. On the next inhale, open up to warrior two, back foot parallel to the short side of your mat and reverse your warrior. Exhale deeply here. Enjoy the stretch of your outer side of your body and back to center. Right hand placed onto your mat. Extend the left arm over your head. Stay here and breathe. Try to open up the chest and push the shoulders back. Inhale, come up, exhale, release your pose, hands down, step back with both of your feet, enjoy your last Chaturanga Dandasana, inhale, lift up for your upward facing dog, exhale, downward facing dog, try to push the heels this time towards the ground as much as possible. And from here, drop the knees down and sit on your heels. Extend your arms in front of you. Rest your forehead down and enjoy the feelings, energy and sensation of lightness and freedom and strength 
moving towards your body. Stay for your child's pose as long as you wish. See you soon for the next video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thank you. Namaste.